Hello guys, welcome back to Civil Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to discuss the physical properties of the structured steel. We know that structured steel is one of the important material in civil engineering that has been commonly used in the buildings, commercial buildings, and bridges, tunnels, and many other mega structures. So the length, the standard length of the steel is usually 12 mm. And we should know about its mechanical and some of its physical properties. So in today's lecture, we are going to discuss its physical properties of the steel reinforcement. And the structured steel is mostly used in order to take the tensile stresses. So if I consider this is a beam, and when the load acts on this beam, these are the supports provided. So here we have some tension at the bottom of the beam and here we have compression so the concrete is strong in compression so here concrete is responsible to take the compression while here at the bottom we have steel reinforcement so this steel reinforcement is responsible to take the tension so structured steel is provided in order to take the tensile stresses in a beam or in a slave or any other flexural member or bending member so structured steel is provided in any member in order to take the tensile stresses in a member. So we should know about its physical properties. So starting with it, some of the important property is the unit mass of the steel. So unit mass of steel presented by rho, it is equal to the 7850 kilogram per cubic meter. So this is the density of the structured steel or the reinforcement. The second property of the steel is physical property is the modulus of elasticity of the steel. Modulus of elasticity. We should also know that the modulus of elasticity of steel is 200,000 mega pascal or we can say 200 gigapascal these are the standard properties of the structured steel so we know that the modulus of elasticity is 200 gigapascal or 200,000 mega pascal the third property is the Poisson ratio of the structured steel and the Poisson ratio is it is usually taken as 0.3 The next one is the coefficient of thermal expansion for the steel reinforcement. Coefficient of thermal expansion. And coefficient of thermal expansion for the steel reinforcement is 12 multiplying it with the 10 raised to the power minus 6 minus 6 per centigrade. So this is the coefficient of thermal expansion of the structural steel. Now the next property, physical property of the steel reinforcement is the modulus of rigidity, which is represented by G and it is equal to the 0 0.769 into 10 to the power 5 megapascal. So this is the modulus of rigidity of the structured steel. So these are some of the important physical properties that we should remember by doing some calculation or by doing some analytical calculation. We should remember these physical properties of the structured steel. So the unit mass of the steel, the modulus of elasticity, which is the young modulus, then the Poisson ratio, the coefficient of thermal expansion, and the modulus of rigidity. So I hope you guys understand. And don't forget to subscribe our channel for daily civil engineering videos. Thank you for watching our video.